Anyone who has worked with a Raspberry Pi knows the frustration all too well. Though the board itself is tiny, the tangle of cables required for programming and development quickly turns the desk into chaos. That mess can sour your mood and derail your workflow. A neat, organized desktop, on the other hand, keeps your mind clear and makes coding, working, and relaxing far more enjoyable. For example, today our protagonist Alan, while using a single Raspberry Pi for office work, found that the interface of the Raspberry Pi was unstable and the keyboard output was unstable. He wanted to check the wiring, but found that it was messy, which would affect his work mood. Alternatively, when he is watching a movie, the display screen he uses is unstable and prone to dropping, which greatly affects the user experience. Alternatively, during the development process using the Raspberry Pi, he needs to connect the Pi to external devices for development, but the pin diagram of the Raspberry Pi is not labeled, so he can only repeatedly refer to the reference diagram online for connection, which is very troublesome. At this point, Alan discovered that there was a mini PC case on the Allegro official website that was equipped with Raspberry Pi for use. Alan planned to purchase this mini case to solve any problems during use. Quickly, our mini PC case has arrived and its appearance is very attractive. Next, we will take out all the accessories from this chassis. And finally, the complete accessories of the chassis are here. You can either follow the step-by-step -step assembly process demonstrated in the video or refer to the detailed assembly manual we have provided to ensure everything is installed correctly. During the assembly, please pay special attention to placing the fan in the correct orientation so that the airflow works as intended and at the same time try to route and hide the wires as neatly as possible. It is also highly recommended to follow the same assembly order we suggest as changing the sequence may make later steps more difficult, affect the layout, or even cause certain parts to be misaligned. After we assemble them, the shape of the complete chassis is presented to us. You can see this chassis, which presents the Raspberry Pi device as a complete device, providing the necessary interfaces such as USB Ethernet port, HDMI TF card slot, Raspberry Pi device pin silk screen, power supply, and OLED screen to display the current CPU running. Status of Raspberry Pi. Then the Raspberry Pi chassis is available, but a cool and stable display screen is still needed to connect to the Raspberry Pi in order to see the Raspberry Pi system interface. At this point, we were using Meteor Screen 10.1 IPS capacitive touchscreen. This Raspberry Pi capacitive touchscreen supports five point touch and multi touch gestures such as click, press, zoom in, slash out, and fast response. With three buttons, you can adjust the screen backlight, RGB light switch, switch the light mode, and adjust the brightness. Just use the included HDMI compatible cable and USB cable to easily connect to the computer without additional operations. Now we are starting to connect the mini PC case and 10.1 inch touchscreen. First, we will connect the keyboard and mouse that we will need to use later, then connect the Ethernet cable to ensure there is a network connection during use. Next, we will use an HDMI cable to connect the mini PC case and 10.1-inch touchscreen so that we can see the Raspberry Pi system interface on the screen. Finally, connect the power cords to both the mini PC case and the 10.1-inch touchscreen, as both require power to function. Use the bracket provided by the 10.1-inch touchscreen to place the screen properly. After all, connections are completed. The overall layout is as shown on the screen. Isn't it much cleaner, more efficient, and clearer than before when using a single Raspberry Pi? This is what we have been thinking about for everyone during the use process. Next, let's experience using the new environment to work, watch movies, develop, and play games. Just like Alan, when using a new environment to work, the overall environment gives people a comfortable and pleasant working mood. Alternatively, when Alan watches movies in a new environment, he remains calm and stable without worrying about any unexpected situations. Alternatively, when Alan is developing in a new environment, he can quickly connect the device according to the Raspberry Pi's pin labeling for development.
After connecting the SAT 7789 display screen and burning the prepared code, he will see Mario's animation displayed on the ST7789 screen. In order to display it as a 3D effect, we added a 3D prism above the screen, which is very nice. Alternatively, Alan can also use game controllers to play games in a new environment, such as the classic Contra, our former youth. For example, in Mario games, using the controller to experience the nostalgia of youth. The new environment created by using mini PC case and 10.1 inch touchscreen in this way has greatly improved the overall experience and provided a completely new feeling. Thank you for watching. Please look forward to more interesting and practical products from us.